So you guys, hi. I read for orange family. I'm actually having a bad day. Not really a bad day, not like anything bad is happening today. I actually planned to have a beautiful day, but something from very tiny thing just came and decided to spoil my mood. And I said, you know what? Let me set up my tripod and film. And then my tripod has been giving me a hala like since but nothing is going to stop me from filming what I want to film. So, so let me tell you guys the backstory. There's this thing that happens to me and my mom. I don't know. Some people say my mom is overreaching. I don't think she's overreaching. She's probably too involved in my life, doesn't know how to let go of you know like i don't think my mom will realize that i'm grown like i can make some certain life choices by myself by the way i'm the only girl of my mom my mom has two boys and me i don't even know how to describe what i'm saying but what i'm saying is that some people would say that my mom is over rich you know over protective or over involved in my life i don't think so Sometimes you should do some kind of thing, so, but I don't think it's too much. Yeah, I don't think it can ever be too much, especially yes, I'm the only daughter she has. She uses me to do a lot of girl mom practices. <laughs> My mom always does this thing where she shops for me. Like, she'll just go somewhere, she'll just see one cloth and she'll just be thinking about me going to buy it if she does not have the money in that moment she will tell the person selling it to keep it and she will go back and buy it so that's what my mom does when it comes to buying me clothes for a very long time i think until i went for nysc i never bought clothes for myself till now i don't think i still buy clothes for myself very well i have clothes given to me or bought for me by my older cousins and my mom that and even till now if i go home with an outfit that my mom doesn't know like she did that thing so much if i go home with an outfit that my mother doesn't know she's going to ask me who is the owner of this clothes <laughs> like my mom she hates like she hates the idea of you wearing somebody's clothes you borrowing somebody's clothes like my mother was really overprotective when we came to that part she didn't want i'm cleaning my mirror she didn't want, you know, any situation where you are borrowing clothes or you are not contented with what you have and all of that. So she did that pretty much till now. She still does it. Like it's something she cannot recognize. She say, ah, ah, which clothes are you wearing? Ah, I mean, I bought it with my money. Oh, this little person gave me. A little person bought it for me. Like I should have said, ah, I'm in now for you or all this kind of thing. Now here's the problem. Buying clothes for me is not the problem. The problem is buying clothes of your taste. Buying clothes that she likes, not the clothes that I like. I'm trying to do a try on haul of the clothes that my mom made for me. She practically does this thing where if you say that you are a tailor and you can sew, my mother is not going to do a credibility check on you whether I'm going to have to turn up this turn on this part. Whether you're good or whether you're she's just going to immediately give you material. So like you whether you so rubbish and bring the woman doesn't she won't bother by be bothered by that. Me I'm usually always bothered when somebody says I do this, I do this. I like to know that you can do something before but my mom no she will test you with her own material and her money. So my mom just calls me and says, she does this all the time, but she says, ah, that she has new tenants and they are tailors, they are male tailors and they sew men's things. I'm like, oh, okay. Ah, the whole town has been coming to them. If you see the crowd, this, that, that, talking to me about them. I knew where she was going like, you know, because I like to sew trousers a lot. You know, you to sew trousers, I give them. I knew that's where she was going, but you can't trust my mother when she says somebody's very good. Because my mother's very good. <laughs> Anybody can be very good to my mom. Uh -huh. So it's not she's not it's not something you can trust basically. So I didn't take her seriously until you know 
I went home and I saw the tailors because they like took the shop in our compound and all of that. I saw them, they were really busy. Like I tell you, throughout the festive period, these guys were working. And their work is really good for no tailor. You think they so pretty well, but I still didn't think of giving them my own clothes. So, so for me, because I have a cousin who sews. Pretty much gives me all her things. <laughs> I didn't feel the but my mom tried them. This is this is I didn't know answer my mother. My mom just calls me one day and she said, I've given those tailors material for you oh, downstairs oh. Uh -huh. Go and give them your measurement though. This is primer. I said, Mommy, ah, to sew what? Don't worry, I told them what to sew. What did you tell them to sew? Learn to sew. The trouser and top for you like kaftan you know ever since i became a teenager and i started growing bots i think since my mom knew that i'm going to be in the league of girls who have a bigger backside yes i have a big backside <laughs> my mother never wanted me to put on trousers without putting on tops that would cover the backside like this started happening since I turned 13, I remember since I turned, since I entered JS3, I was 13 in JS3. So my mom just never wanted that. She, it's either you're wearing trousers with long tops like kaftan or you're not wearing. Choose one. That was always the fight. I mean, I always wanted to show off my shape at that age. I had really beautiful shape at all. Maybe now if I don't feel it. My beautiful orange family welcome back to my youtube channel if you're a returning subscriber thank you for always finding my videos worthy of your time and if you have seen my video for the first time thank you so much for being here i hope you've been watch my old videos i hope you subscribe like and then be a part of this beautiful orange family i'm done with my makeup and i'm just looking for a place where i can place my phone so that we can get the full view of the look Unfortunately guys, I don't think there is a way for us to because I have to record in landscape mode. So let's get into the video. But before we get into the video, please subscribe to my channel, like this video, leave a thumbs up, let me know what you think about these outfits in the comment section. Let's go. Let's go. Which outfit are we going with first? I'll show you something. Normally, I'll just wear the dress and show you people. But because we're rating my mother's tailors, I'll show you something. Okay. See the trouser. I like it though, funny enough. It's giving joggers vibes. This is what the trouser looks like. Mm. You carry for set. Don't cause I partage. I think I specifically told the tailors that I want something very free because I'm flying a lot with bike, so I don't want anything that once I open my leg like this, you don't see. Ah, I'm sure you guys must have noticed something by now. What did you notice? It is orange, of course. It's my favorite color. My favorite color. So I like this. I like what this outfit is giving to be honest. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So I decided to record in portrait so that you guys can see. Have a full look. What is the giving? What is the giving? I told you guys this is how my mom loves me to wear trousers. She wants me to put on a trouser with something covering the ikebe. But if it's there, it's there. You cannot hide it. Thank you. Hey, wait. Why does it feel like something has Okay, no. <laughs> it's the pin-up I'm wearing inside. <laughs> Imagine if you had torn. I told this boys I want to be free. I love this look. I love it. If I'm going to church on Sunday, this but I'm wearing. Wait, let me try the other one. <laughs> let me confess something to you guys. When my mom bought this fabric, yeah? You people know this fabric is Burberry, <laughs> Burberry design. I laughed and laughed and laughed, but and so what? And so what? 
<laughs> no, 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 it's fine, you guys, don't get me wrong. But I have to raise up my shirt like this, to put my hand in my pocket, giving a dog, giving Bilonia, oh yeah, the cash, chopping and spending the cash. There is no mercy for money. Okay, why? Oh, the cash. I like it, I like it. So let me tell you guys this story about this one here. My mom is that kind of person that would have five different clothes of the same style. The same style, different fabrics, five. And I don't know why somebody would have the same thing in five places. Like, just buy different things. But that's it, that's about the taste of my mom. So she had told them to sew the same style like the previous one for this one. So I went to meet the tailors, I'm like, please do something different. In this case, I prefer you do something like a dance shiki and that's how this one came about. Well, the reason why I love this dress is because I can wear the top as a dress. As you guys can probably see, I can wear it as a dress. But I would have loved if they did something like this, like a butterfly thingy. But it's really still so fine. Check me out, check me out. Bam. Bam. Bada ba boom. <laughs> hey, Odogu, Odogu. It's giving Odogu rest. In fact, this is the one I'm wearing to church. On Sunday. It's still orange. So give it some orange. I think I prefer this fabric because it is not Burberry, obviously. I love it. Love it, love it. I'm rating this. What did I rate the previous one? Cheetos. I don't think I rated that one. No. Please let me know what you rate that. I think I rate that one a 7 over 10 because of the fabric. I have a problem with the fact that it's an imitation of the Burberry design. So I'm rating that 7 over 10. I'm rating this. What am I rating this? Maybe a 7 2. It's fine. I love it. Don't get me wrong. Rating the 7 2 because I'd have to raise it up like this to put my hand in my pocket, which isn't so bad. I would have loved a pocket here instead or here, and then not so free, probably something like this. Something like this. Yeah, that's how I would have loved it. So that the bomb bomb come bomb bomb, but I love it. Love the outfit. I mean, it's my makeup that is making all these clothes to be fine. That's why I tell me do makeup. Oh. They are male tailors, so, so you'd expect them to actually get the trouser correctly. But it's not so like female trousers, it's actually so like man boy trousers. It's free, it's not tight. Can ah, that hot. Sorry, let's get into the next. So, the next outfit I want to wear is not made by these tailors, it's made by a female tailor that. One of those people that my mom also said, oh, she can do this, she can do this, she... I don't really like this cloth, because the picture I sent to her is a skirt and a top, but she made a gown instead, so... I'm kind of sentimental towards it, but I've never tried it, so let's try it! I want to leave it alone, I want to leave it alone, guess what? There is nobody to zip up this dress for me. I like what it's giving. I'm so sorry for bashing this tailor. It's giving! I can't turn back because I could not, but I will turn back. I will turn back. Oh my god. Please, when is the next party? This is what I'm wearing. Ah, God, I should have accessorized properly. I didn't think it would come out this good. Oh, I think it's my, I think it's my carriage and my makeup, my charisma, my everything. Check it, check it, check it, check it. Please, when is the next party? Ah, oh, God. See now. Let's take some time to appreciate my shape first. Oh my God! It's fine, no! I don't fancy what I'm saying. I don't just be happy myself. This dress is beautiful. Let me know what you guys rate this dress. I mean, I was sad about this dress because I wanted this part to be a separate top on its own. And this is curved. But I like that it's a dress at the end of the day. 
it's beautiful nobody to zip the dress for me but even though up on still we move the show must go on mm, let me take some photos so you guys this next set of outfits are short but i think the materials were not enough to do anything so my mom just says shorts i would have loved to style this shirt with a plain white tee but i cannot find a plain white polo in my wardrobe and i don't know why so i just picked up anything that's white and that's how i landed with this please let me know how you'd style it if it was you how you'd prefer to style it because i don't know how else I don't know if it's the top that's the problem, but I really wanted to give you a bodysuit vibe. Maybe this is not the right bodysuit. I don't know. It's just not giving. I think I would have preferred if this shirt was shorter, like up here, because this is my mother's handwork. Now it's not so bad. It's quite big around here. I don't know, man. I don't know. What do you guys think? It's probably good, but I'm not feeling it. And I have two of this, and I don't even know what to use for the other one. Still, a fine girl is a fine girl. What would you rate this? I rate this a four over ten. Four because I've not styled it perfectly, so largely my fault. Then four because I would have preferred it to be shorter. Not this long because now I don't know what to do with this. Four over ten. I mean, four for effort, right? You guys, I regret to announce that we have come to the end of that video. <laughs> See, my makeup is already smoldering from taking off wearing the last um, outfit is a short as well, just like the other one, different fabric. I figured that is the same thing, and I did not find the right fitting that i want it's just giving the previous vibe so there's no need try on hauls are not easy but i hope you enjoyed this video hope you enjoyed my vibe please give this video a thumbs up let me know the outfits that you loved the most rate every outfit let me know if my mom's tailors did well let me know if my mom's taste is your taste you like it let me know if your mother is like my mother i mean i'm blessed to have her in my life do you like my makeup thank you for watching my video i love you Mwah.